Welcome back, uh, ladies and gentlemen. And as promised earlier today, of course, we will be uh, celebrating the success and the 46th anniversary of the 6th of October war victory. And I'm delighted to be joined this afternoon in the studio by my guest, Dr. Hassan al Haywan, professor from Ain Shams University. Doctor, thank you so much for coming in this afternoon. You're welcome. I'm, I'm, Doctor, I appreciate you Doctor, now, uh, thank you so me. much. Thank okay. you so much, Doctor. Now, in the countdown to the war, we're talking about seven long years yes. of low morale, of uh, dire economic circumstances, of lots of challenges and struggles. But after these seven years, victory, finally. Uh, what does this tell us about the way that Egyptians were, uh, their patients, and how patients will lead to success? Okay, I mean, first of all, wars mm. are not an entertaining mm -hmm. business. Mm -hmm. Wars are very destructive. Indeed. And uh, if you go to war, you have to have a very justified reason. Yes. In the 67 war, uh, we were actually uh, took by surprise. Mm. And the, the, most of the army equipment were destroyed. And we lost a lot of uh, soldiers and officers mm -hmm. in, uh, in Sinai. Mm -hmm. From maybe 10 days after the, this catastrophic uh, defeat, mm. the army started to do things which were very exceptional. Mm -hmm. in, in July, they have uh, some attacks on the uh, Israeli uh, troops. Uh, the Air Force even, it was totally destroyed, still have some action mm -hmm. on Sinai. But the issue is that people realized that, that we might have lost the battle, yes. but not the war. Yes. And this was due to the, actually, to Egyptian leadership during this time. Mm -hmm. President Nasser was very uh, much involved in two areas, mm -hmm. domestic uh, front and the international front, rebuilding mm -hmm. the army and, uh, in a way, reviewing all the domestic issues, mm -hmm. which was one of the causes of this defeat. Yes reviewing uh, the, the way uh, uh, the rule of, uh, of the one party uh, uh, the domination mm. I mean the whole mm -hmm. political system mm -hmm. was reviewed mm -hmm. now three years uh, he was rebuilding yes the issue was that he started using the very professional and trade and trained commanders in all uh, branches of the military, mm -hmm. the Navy, the Air Force, uh, the artillery, I mean, all areas, he uh, actually picked the most qualified, Outer. the most uh, trained mm -hmm. uh, generals mm -hmm. and staff. Mm -hmm. The second thing is that he drafted a law that uh, the soldiers should be college graduates. Mm -hmm. Because this, the war now is technological. Mm. It's, not, it's not a mass mm. uh, uh, war. I mean, you have to have the ability to learn and train on very sophisticated equipment. Mm. And this was another mm. turning point. Mm -hmm. uh, in three years, he died in 1970. Mm. And then President Sadat took over. He continued this. The most important issue here is that the Israelis, after they won the 67 war, mm -hmm. they were very li relaxed. Mm -hmm. And they have this... Uh, uh, arrogance, maybe. Arrogant mm -hmm. and concept mm -hmm. that the Egyptians... Are broken. Broken. Mm -hmm. President Sadat is not serious. Mm -hmm. Yes. And he don't have uh, the ability mm -hmm. to uh, wage war. Mm -hmm. And this was one part of the success. Mm -hmm. The image about the Egyptian army, mm -hmm. about the president himself, said that. Mm -hmm. And actually, I was drafted during this time. Mm -hmm. I was a sh surgeon. Okay. Uh, actually, nobody believed that we are going to go to war. Mm -hmm. Except Even maybe the army. The, uh, the army mm -hmm. were training mm -hmm. very seriously. Mm -hmm but they never knew when. Mm. Mm -hmm. It was a top, top, top secret decision. Yes. And this was one of the reasons. Now, when I think about it, go back 46 years ago, mm -hmm. 
I realized that three points. First of all, the spirit. Mm. Second, recovering our land, mm. occupied land. Third, our honor and pride. Mm -hmm. Because these are three elements, mm. extremely important for anyone, even the uh, civilians. Mm. Everybody was having this spirit and having this determination mm -hmm. and having this will to recover our dignity and our pride. And for a long time. Of course, I mean, I mean seven, seven years. years. Seven it's years. Not a couple of months no, no, or seven two years. years. It's seven yes, years of so waiting. Of waiting. Mm. In the last two years, 71. 72 mm. people start uh, thinking that there is no war mm. in, in, in sight. Uh, I was dead sure mm. that the war is coming, mm. but I'm not sure that it's coming in October. I mean, I, I know that sometime it's happening soon. Soon, mm. nobody know, knows that it's going to happen. Mm -hmm. And the, 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 the point is that you, you remember that. Uh, 6th of October was 10th of Ramadan Yes. and Yom, Yom Kippur mm. in Israel mm. two holy uh, days dates. for each mm. and the planning of the war to be uh, 6th of October 2 o'clock in the afternoon was very very uh, genius mm. for, for s some reasons we discovered later mm -hmm. first of all because Israelis cannot uh, recall the troops mm. and in, in four hours dark will uh, fall mm -hmm. and the current of the Suez Canal and the sun mm. because one of the points that the sun will will be in the faces of the Israeli troops mm -hmm. uh, at two o'clock in the, in the, the afternoon, afternoon. Mm. so the timing itself mm. was genius mm. uh, of course, I mean, everybody knows that what happened. Yes. But I mean, I want to stress the point that the spirit and the uh, seriousness and uh, how we want to regain mm -hmm. our pride and honor, mm -hmm. this was the lessons we right. all learned mm -hmm. from this war. Because mm -hmm. as I said, mm -hmm. war is not a picnic. Mm -hmm. War is very costly. Yes. Humans and equipment. Yes, and when Egypt actually launched uh, the war in 1973, it wasn't a rich country. No. It was, you know, it wasn't no, yet a rich country. Actually, it had very limited resources at the time. Limited resources and equipment cannot mm. match the sophistication mm. of the Israeli mm -hmm. side, uh, the, the air force or the, the tanks mm -hmm. or everything. Mm -hmm. But again, the, 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 the secret word is the spirit. Mm -hmm. The determination. determination. I, the, when I, to, I talk about spirit, mm. I mean, how can we continue this spirit yes. of victory? Yes. How can we continue to mm. be serious? Mm -hmm. How can we continue to determine? Mm -hmm. How can we continue to have goals and we, not, we want to reach these goals? Mm -hmm. I mean, this is the issue now. that we have uh, to, to stress mm -hmm. on and uh, keep uh, not only the young, everybody, mm -hmm. the whole hundred million Egyptians yes. should have this thing. How, doctor? You asked the perfect question. Oh my How? God. <laughs> How can we? What does it take? Do you think Egyptians have changed since uh, then? I mean, change in what? In quality? Maybe in patience. In, uh, maybe they're in more in a, in a hurry now for... Everybody's in a hurry. Mm, mm. I mean, this is the pace of, of, of the whole modern, day, yes. modern days. Mm. But uh, we need to keep reminding people. Yes. Not a, a, as a victory in a, in a war, mm. but the lessons learned from it. Yes. I mean, we don't, talk, we didn't, we don't want to keep talking about the war and we want a war. And uh, this is not the issue. Mm -hmm. The issue is that the reasons we want this war... Yes. It's a spirit, determination, honor, pride. I mean, these are uh, the, the, the issues. The serious issues, yes. yes. Mm -hmm. Which we need to keep on stressing so that people keep on living in this mm -hmm. uh, mood, I mean. Mm -hmm. um, Egypt is not specifically now in a war. It's in a different kind of war. It's in a war against terrorism. It's in a war against extremism, fundamental ideas. How can we apply 
the lessons from the October war victory to today's kind of war that Egypt is facing in the region? Okay. First, I mean, defining war mm. does not mean that we have to use military equipment yes. and kill, kill each other. Mm -hmm. I mean, war is against poverty, mm -hmm. war is against uh, ignorance, mm -hmm. war yes. is against uh, 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 lack of, uh, of development. Mm -hmm. So uh, we are on a continuous war mm -hmm. so that we can advance. Yes. So it's not a matter of using uh, weapons, weapons and yes. killing each other. Mm -hmm. So people should understand again mm. that we are uh, uh, waging a war against poverty, against mm. uh, ignorance, against uh, uh, how can we embed in the people's conscience that if we want to advance, mm. we need to be very serious. Mm -hmm. We need to be patient. Mm -hmm. We need to work hard. Mm -hmm. And this is, this is what we call a psychological war. Yes. So that we can advance. Mm -hmm. Doctor, you are a professor yes. at a university. You deal with a lot of youngsters, yes. a lot of the Egyptian youth. You're more in touch maybe than other people with their mentality. Tell me, do they have that potential that you're talking about? Uh, some of them, mm -hmm. definitely. Mm -hmm. Some of them are very, very concerned, very interested in, in the future. Mm -hmm. and, and some of them are a, a little bit uh, on the sideline. Mm. In the sideline as an apathetic? Uh, no, I mean, they don't care. Mm. They're not interested. So we, we need to pull them all. But the issue, mm. I mean, you know, no, uh, education is not only a book. And, uh, and, of course. Uh, education is a whole set of, of, uh, of concepts and activities. Mm. I remember during my days, mm. I'm very old, uh, we have a lot of activities. We were too much engaged yes. in what's happening socially, mm. what's happening in our community, in our uh, trips and charity events and uh, activities yes. all the time. So we need we need them to do that. Mm. But of course, I mean, it needs resources. Mm. Uh, uh, you know, I mean, the Faculty of Commerce to have mm. more than sixty, seventy thousand students. Mm. And needs good planning as well. Good I planning, mm. some resources, mm. uh, dedication. And the spirit. The spirit. The spirit. The spirit. In spirit. Indeed. Yes. I'm afraid we've run out of time much quicker than I would have liked. I'd like thank to thank you. you very much, Dr. Hassan Haiwan, Professor of Main Chance University. It's been an absolute pleasure. Thank you so much uh, for thank coming this afternoon. Thank you for having me. Thank you, sir. Thank you. With that, ladies and gentlemen, we wrap up today's edition of Cairo Local Time. We do hope you have enjoyed it. My name is Angie Mehrmani. Thanks for watching.